Vi ved, at der har været tre læk på Nord Stream 2 og Nord Stream 1. Det er på Nord Stream 2. Det fandt sted natten til mandag, og det på Nord Stream 1, det fandt sted mandag aften. Der siver rigtig meget gas ud. Det vil sige, at det er måske flere millioner kubikmeter i timen samlet set, der flyder ud, så rørene er ved at blive tømt. Men der vil gå flere dage, før at de er helt tømt. Det er meget sjældent, at der sker skader af den her karakter. Og nu er der sket tre skader på, ja, inden for et døgn. Og derfor er vi også øh, meget bekymret for, hvad det er, der kan være årsag til det her. My understanding is the leaks will not have a significant impact on Europe's energy resilience. Um, and what's critical is that we are working day in, day out, both on a short-term basis and a long-term basis, to address uh, energy security for, uh, for Europe and, uh, and for that matter around the world. The leaks are under investigation. Um, their initial reports indicating that uh, this may be the result of an attack or some kind of sabotage, but these are initial reports and we haven't confirmed that yet. But if it is confirmed, that's clearly in, in no one's interest. When you look at the complexity of the attacks and uh, how difficult it is to carry uh, carry out such an, such an act of sabotage, um, then it's most likely that a, um, a, state, a state actor is involved. Um, and there are only one state actor in the Baltic um, that is where, it, where the, the possibility, the capabilities uh, and the motivation uh, come together and that is obviously Russia. Uh, one might be uh, an, an accident um, that could be a, a solution um, if there would be only like one leakage. Um, but if we look at the, the fact that we have three leakages that occurred uh, almost uh, simultaneously, um, then it's most likely that it's sabotage. One can speculate about it, but one possible um, um, aim of Russia might be strategic signaling towards NATO and towards the West um, to show, uh, look, we are able to, to manipulate, to, to sabotage uh, criti critical infrastructure um, uh, mounted on the seabed. 